my channel. If you're new here, my name is Yelena and I make a lot of lifestyle videos. I have an almost five month old baby boy. So today I thought I would share all my kind of like newborn baby essentials or newborn baby must haves. Now that I kind of went through that phase with my baby and he is much older, I thought I would just share all the must haves um, that you may need for your baby. Now this could be different for everyone, but I just thought these were kind of like the essentials that you may want to have um, for your baby. And obviously I still use these things. So it's not just for newborns. It's also just, you know, you can continue to use these as your baby grows. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get started. My first must have for a newborn would be a little kit like this it's just like a safety kit which i will link everything down below for you guys where you can get it on amazon um and this is just like safety first kit and it has like um the little nail clipper which i have used a lot especially when grayson was um really little because his nails just grew so fast and he would keep scratching himself so i use this a lot and I still use this at least once or twice a week. And then it has um, the thermometer in here, which I really like. So it has pretty much everything that you need in there. One of these, um, there's like a little toothbrush, which obviously I don't need that right now, but um, there's like a little bottle in here if you need this for something. But yeah, definitely recommend this little safety kit. It also comes with, um, little nail file files filers nail file files um so if you were to, if you are too afraid why can't i talk tonight if you are too afraid to um clip your baby's nails i really recommend the little nail files i didn't really use this because i was really comfortable cutting grayson's nails but um definitely recommend one of these kits for your newborn and then I also recommend after, okay, someone's car is so obnoxious and loud. Um, sorry about that. I hope it doesn't wake Grayson up because it's kind of like, it's 10.20 right now and I'm recording this video, so it's pretty late. Um, anyway, another thing I recommend is these baby Q-tips. It says baby safety swabs, so I, started using these right away when he was home from the hospital and after i give him a bath and everything i just use these they're a lot bigger than you know like the regular q-tips so they're like thicker and uh, you can get these also i think at any store but i will like i said link everything down below for you guys and then um i'll do some more essentials this was um, approved by my pediatrician or Grayson's pediatrician. It's the gripe water. I'm sure you guys probably have heard of it, but this is the nighttime one. It says relieves occasional stomach discomfort from gas, colic, fussiness, or hiccups. And it's supposed to be like natural. I have used this a lot um, with babies that I have previously nannied. So I have known that this actually works really well. And I've used it a few times with Grayson when he was born. Well, no, the first like month or so. I used that like a couple times at night when he um, had a lot of like gassiness and stuff like that and like tummy aches. And it just really, really calms him down and helps them sleep. So I definitely recommend getting this one. There's other other ones that are just like regular not nighttime but i didn't want to just like depend on this so i just use this if like it's just really necessary so definitely recommend that um but i would also talk to your pediatrician and do what you're comfortable with these are just like things that i think are essential and then another thing that i got are these baby super daily d3s like vitamin d drops these were recommended also by my pediatrician and i got these from i believe whole foods yeah they were quite a bit i think they were like almost 15 dollars, but they're definitely worth it i heard that they're really good ones so i'll try to link these down below as well for you guys so 
you're obviously going to need to get vitamin D drops for your baby and um, these are 365 drops so it looks like this it's just like a little bottle and you just take one drop out and then i usually just put it on my finger and put it on his tongue and that's just like what has worked for me since he was a, just like a little you know since he was a tiny little baby <laughs> he's still tiny but you know what i mean and then another thing this my best friend actually got this for me but i have literally been obsessed with this and loving this i've been using this every time that grayson takes a bath um, and it's the Johnson's Bedtime Lotion. Um, I feel like it's really calming after he takes a bath or after I give him a bath. And I, before I put his PJs on, I just give him like a little massage with this and it smells really good and just very calming. I feel like this helps him sleep, honestly, because it just has a really like good smell and it's just like, I don't know. I just really like it. So I just, and then onto some more newborn essentials are these baby dove tip to toe wash. I love dove stuff. So this has been one of my favorites since he was born. It just smells really, really good. It says hypoallergenic, tear free, dermatologist and pediatrician tested. They actually gave this to me at our pedi pediatrician office and I have loved using it. It's fragrance free, sensitive moisture and it's, I just love this baby wash. I have still, or I still continue to use it um, and I've used it pretty much since day one since he got home from the hospital. So I really recommend this one. It's, he's never had any problems with it, no rashes or anything like that. It's just very gentle on the skin definitely love this and then on to another one that I really love this is the honest shampoo and body wash ultra calming and it's dreamy lavender natural hypoallergenic tear free this stuff is also amazing it's so calming lavender like helps you sleep and you probably have used it I use lavender a lot as my like essential oils so this stuff is amazing and honest company like I love their products it's all natural it's just a really good brand. Um, so, and I feel like this also helps him sleep because it's very calming and just lavender in general is just, um, it's just like, you know, helps you sleep. And it's another thing that I really recommend as a must have are these little um, washcloths because they're really useful. Grace Fun, Grace Fun, uh, Grayson had like um, one of those like swollen or I, forgot ripped tear ducts where he would constantly have like eye boogies when he would wake up and just like crusties and his eye would constantly be kind of like runny so these were super helpful and gentle I would just make them warm or like run them under warm water and just kind of like clean his eyes so I definitely th think these are must have because they're really gentle on the skin and they're not gonna like scratch his eyes or anything so it's just like little washcloths. And then another thing I really recommend for a newborn must have is a lot of um, burp cloths. You literally could not get enough burp cloths. Like babies spit up all the time. Babies, you know, just like, you just want to be prepared. So burp cloths, just definitely get a bunch of burp cloths because you will never have enough of those um i have literally a million of them um because i'm just i was constantly like grabbing burp cloths whenever he was born and we got home from the hospital whether it's when you're after feeding him or anything his babies just spit up all the time so you just always need them with you i just put them like in my diaper bag just all over the place and then another newborn must have that i thought was really cute and helpful was this um this is by carters and it's zero to nine months so i guess it fits like you know it can still fit him right now which i don't really use this with grayson right now because he sleeps pretty well without anything but it's one of these uh little sleepers which it has like no legs or whatever and it just keeps them cozy and it's kind of like a swaddle swaddle but not really so you can just put them in here and it's just very soft and cozy and Grace and I know liked sleeping in this um, for a couple months when he was born and um, 
I don't see I haven't used this in a while, but I really like this. It's just really cozy and soft. And um, what else? Okay, this is definitely a must-have because you know babies get a lot of boogies, and this is the Frida baby nose Frida. You guys have probably heard of it. I used this a bunch of times when Grayson was born. It looks like this. Um, the whole idea of it is kind of disgusting and it grossed me off for a while, but when I got it and when you have your own baby, it's not that gross at all. Um, I thought that was gonna be way worse, but it really honestly wasn't that bad. So um, it comes with ours, I guess. Some of them don't come with the drops, like the saline drops or whatever they're called, saline snot spray. And it comes with 10 filters, so filters look like this. And basically you just like put the filter in here and then you go like this. All this is washable. And then um, you just suck through this part, put it on the nose, on the, in the nostril. And then um, to help get like the boogies kind of like out if they're too dry or whatever, you can just put the little saline drops in the nose. And I really found this helpful because whenever he started getting boogies, it was like you could hear him having a hard time breathing and stuff. So this really helped a lot. Um, if you're grossed out by it, just don't even think about it because it helps your baby breathe and it's not gross at all. You don't touch anything, it doesn't go in your mouth. Like it's whatever. Um, and then last but not least for newborn essentials, this is one of those like wraps um this is by cuddlebug it's from amazon and it was honestly one of the best things that i got for when he was born and for the first like couple months that he was home from the hospital or the first like couple weeks that he was home from the hospital um this is just really really soft and it's a wrap so you just you know wrap them up and it just makes the baby feel close to you and you feel close with the baby and it's just like it's really comforting for them grayson slept in this so well like around me whenever we went anywhere or just around the house if i wanted some stuff done he just slept really well in this i absolutely love this i wish he still liked it and but he's just getting so big um i just love using using this because it just made me feel really close to him and I just would wrap him around me like when I went on walks or to the grocery store, just anywhere and around the house. And um, he just loved sleeping in this and it just made him feel close. And it was like, you know, having that skin to skin contact is really important with your baby. So I really recommend getting one of these. I will link this one down below and um, it's really easy to use. There's like a bunch of tutorials online. But yeah, that is pretty much all of my newborn baby essentials these were just the things that um were really helpful to me when i first had grayson and i hope these newborn essentials help you and obviously this is not like everything but these are just the things that i literally use pretty much on a daily basis so i hope these newborn essentials are helpful to you if you have any Sorry, <laughs> if you have any comments, suggestions, or questions, or anything like that, just leave them down below for me, and I will be happy to answer those or address those. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, enjoyed this newborn essentials, and um, don't forget to thumbs up this video, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Feel just like an astronaut. I was in the corner. Trapped inside I forgot to look beyond